Welcome back. If you're new here, hello. My name is Katie, and today I'm going to be reacting to episodes 263 and 264 of One Piece. And at the moment, we are still on the trains on our way to Ennis Lobby. And in the last episode, uh, the Rocket Man nearly collided with the frog that was friends with Tom and Frankie and Iceberg when they were younger. Luffy, like, really didn't want to collide with him. We didn't see the collision of what happened. I don't know if the frog is like trying to stop the train or like what his deal is, but I guess we'll find out. And then over in the other train in the Puffing Tom, Sanji and Usopp and Frankie and Robin were with CP9. And instead of fighting them, they Frankie decided to sacrifice himself to detach the carriages and let Robin kind of escape with... Uh, Sanji and Usopp but at the end of the episode one of the CP9 guys who has that door ability ended up being able to see himself into the carriage that they are in and all the while we are waiting to hear Robin's freaking backstory and why she is so stubborn about not being rescued so maybe we'll get more insight into that in these episodes but before we get into it if you want to see more content from me don't forget to subscribe you can also join my Patreon for three dollars a month if you would like early access content without further ado let's get into episode 263 of one piece air door so he can do that on like an actual wall and he can do it in thin air which is kind of crazy but can they go through as well oh Oh shit! No! Oh, oh, so bless. Oh my god, be careful. He's already so injured from everything that he's already been through. This is just no use. <gasps> A weak kick? Their energy is already depleted. She's still so worried about them. Her voice is so... Like, the nerves in her voice, you can hear it. She is. Yeah. She's not gonna say it, though. Oopie. Oh, I just got chills. Backstory? 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 Was her home attacked? Like, what is this? <gasps> oh my goodness. Oh, not quite yet, I guess. She looks so sad. Robin, what is going on, girly? What? たった that is so fucked up. Threatening her with her own trauma? What? This doesn't give any more explanation as to why she's seen as a devil, though. All we know so far is that she was a survivor of her island that got destroyed. Oh, Sanji! Yeah! 
It's no use. They can't do anything. Poor Robin. This is so fucked up. Literally, like, threatening her with her own trauma. <laughs> oh shit, we got derailed? Oh no, well, where are we now then? <laughs> yeah, they look great. Ouch. Oh, Chopper! <gasps> oh no! Did they lose them? So, like, what are we on right now? Are we on the rail anymore? Like, what are we doing? Is he asleep? He's asleep. That, that's my man. <laughs> nah, we're the same. I could sleep through anything too. I get it. Is she getting us back on track? She seems to be like doing something now. <laughs> I mean, it seems like we're still on a track. I have faith in this girly. Nice. Nami doing her thing. Hell yeah, she is. What is a frog? What is frog doing? Like, what the? Does he just? He's glad they're okay, but he derailed them. Oh, he thought they got kidnapped. He's a good boy. He was just looking out for her. What? Did they just call her a frog? Oh yeah, there was some of them actually on this attachment, so... So are they stuck? Like, have they stopped? Oh, I guess not, because they still have these guys. That's gotta be Sanji and Usopp. Oh, Sanji! Spring eyebrows! <laughs> Nightless? Interesting. He feels nostalgic for a judicial island. What is this fucking guy? <laughs> what is he? Told what? That they're gonna be executed? Oh. The iceberg is still alive. Aww. Oopie. So they're gonna maybe get them to do the things that they can do, and then they're gonna kill them. And that's their plan for ending the pirate era. That's so fucked up. That's so fucked up. They talk about justice, but it's just about control. And like, I get that pirates cause a lot of problems, but ultimately, it is about control. Yeah, 
What does that even mean? They can relate. Oh, Frankie understands. Oh, Frankie. This is probably like the first time she's heard that people saying this to her like over and over and over again. No wonder she is the way that she is. What do you mean? Why is he being challenging it? Oh, just to train to become strong after Tom died? Oh. Oh, poor frog. Hey, yo, let's get the frog to fight. Yeah. He loves Frankie. Hell yeah, he will. Yeah. I love that Luffy was just listening along to that, like, okay. Oh my god, besties! <laughs> That's so funny. From the start of the episode, fighting to that is just so Luffy in it. <laughs> He's biting him. <laughs> so we're finally in Ennis lobby. It feels like this has been anticipated for so fucking long. Oh. It looks very pretty. Whoa. It's like a castle. Whoa. Is that water all around? Yeah, like a water. Oh my god. What? Uh, I was not, I don't know. I, I mean, I don't know what I was expecting, but that looks crazy. That looks crazy. Okay, I'm excited that we're finally here to see what happens while, while we're here. And hopefully the Straw Hats arrive pretty soon. But let's just get into the next episode. Who's this? Who, who are they? Are they the government? <laughs> They're all getting emotional <laughs> over Frankie. Honestly, mood though. Interesting that it's called Nightless. Like, what is that all about? Is it actually literally Nightless? Oh, they really don't. That day island. Interesting. <gasps> Yay! And we're so close. Aww. Luffy's so funny. Like, the others are gonna recognize him straight away, and Luffy's gonna be like, Who's that? <laughs> oh boy. I'm assuming one of them is the Spando Ballet guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Who are they, though? Who are they? Hello. <laughs> The zip for the mouth? What is going on? <laughs> they do not have the voice that I thought that they were <laughs> That's so creepy. Yeah, he does not have the kind of voice I expected. <laughs> They're like... They're all very chaotic. 
compared to the CP9 that we met first. Yeah, compared to the CP9 that we've already met, like, these guys are so chaotic. How are they the people in charge of all of this? You know what I mean? Like, how are they the people that, like, Lu Lucy, Lu Luchi, Luki is taking uh, orders from? Do you know? Luffy's obsessed. He's in awe. <laughs> Oh, Usopp's best friend. Yeah, I knew they would all know straight away. <laughs> even they know, and they're not even besties with him. Even she knows. Oh, Chopper and Luffy. In your hearts. I cannot. I cannot. They are such babies. They are so cute. Mm, what's he gonna say? Talking about her trauma and how they're fucking using it against her. <laughs> Luffy just sees it so plain and simple. I love him so much. There's a technique. Ooh, that's helpful. How do you get across to that place? Hell yeah. Ooh. Oh my god, okay. Sixty versus thousands, that's scary. Yeah, that's a good idea. Reserve their energy for CP9. They are the biggest problem. Hmm. Oh, those are the gates of justice? What? What? Oh my god. This place is so scary. Oh, look at Chopper's little jacket. What is he doing? <gasps> Oofy, was he supposed... Was he supposed to- Luffy, what are you doing? Didn't he just say got it? He listened to the whole plan. He, d he did. <laughs> this is actually such a scary thing that they're doing, considering how many people are there and how powerful CP9 are, but... He 
he is just going for it. It really does. It looks deserted. <laughs> I wonder how they found him up there. He was very hidden from sight, honestly. <laughs> oh my god, this is just... <laughs> Makes me laugh so much. This just gets you even more excited for the arc because the way Luffy just like, he just goes for it. Fuck a plan. He knows what he's doing though. I'm intrigued of what he said about wanting to try out a technique. Mm. Doesn't seem worried about these guys. The way he has such a reputation now makes me feel so proud. That is Straw Hat Luffy! That's our boy! <laughs> oh, I love him. Believe in Luffy. Believe. Oh, that was a cool ending. Oh my gosh, we are finally here. We have made it to Ennis Lobby. I am so excited to see what happens. I really don't know what to expect because they were going in with a plan and Luffy was like, fuck a plan. So who knows what's going to happen. So if you enjoyed this reaction, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more content from me, don't forget to subscribe. You can also join my Patreon for early access content if you want to. But in the meantime, take care of yourselves and I will see you in the next one. Okay, bye.